Alright. Go buy some new equipment. Starting with this class, Lexion Experimental. We got new mods and new machines, everything. Every day. New stuff every day. Let's see here. This thing looks pretty small. Oh my god. This thing holds a hundred thousand. Nine hundred horsepower engine. Has tires on it. That is thing. Test it out. This is a class ninety foot header. I'm talking about this holds six hundred and fifty thousand. That's crazy. I see controls. Nice. You definitely rock with this new combine here. So lights. Side windshield wiper. We're gonna definitely like this one. Map, quick, quick. That's how we rock, man, with tracks.
Alright, they got a Krispy Kreme donut shop on here. Like a factory. That's a Krispy Kreme factory. Alley Greens, Outback Grain, Spinnery at the bottom, Barn, Tombstone Grain, Cook Sale, Old Grain Store.
David Richman Gaming. What's up, dude? How you doing? This new map here, man. It's eight times smoother. I remember this map was laggy, the original. One better. Cab moves. Dynamic cab. Dynamic suspension. This is the ripper highest. 50 horsepower, the other one got like 320. There. or something. Two. Ah, I subscribe to that. Ah. Uh, no. Yeah, but it's hard. I can't. I can't. It's like, I'll play Fortnite, but no. Jumping up and down building fortresses and shit in the damn middle of the air and oh you saw that? I almost rolled this bitch over <laughs> and McDonald's on this map. Hey no, it's a mod. The only thing you want mods. Make them. I almost rolled that bitch over. Man.
I'm gonna stretch this field out. Short. Not gonna be doing no fields and be wasting my time. We're gonna make it bigger. Plow it, seed it, fertilize it. This brand new fin.
Okay, he gets a field too. Why not?
found another spot to put some coin in. Hey, I see we got some haters up in here. Running their mouth. Hey, Christian. All right. Why? Why is stupid is why? Why? Girl, you were asking for it. Yeah, what you were looking for. Oh, happy now. Now I'm trying to post it. Fucking sack of shit. Creating new fields or on. No, oh, it's not. They just won't let me put it there. Why? It's cool. Yo, it's cool. It's cool. Those who once want to spam on my channel, you know, just get blocked like forever. Play that. 35 years old, man. Ain't got time to be playing with y'all little kids. Try to help y'all here by trying little ideas streaming this game. Don't need to be cursing at me for no reason. Some kind of a problem or something. You know. I don't get paid to babysit. Here's another connector for corn. So all this area over here will be just corn, corn. Eight, two corn fields and expanded one.
he said hola and all this Spanish speaking. Yeah, man. Hey, hi. Hello to you, too. We speak English, dude. No Spanish in here. English only. Pull it. Pull it. Come on. Pull it.
better get him before I hit him. I'm telling you. Better get him. Because I'm going to hit him. Alright, I have corn for days. I want some of those corn salads, bunkers. Put them up. Not to be plant, we're gonna buy some cows. Get them water and straw and stuff. Using new equipment, new mods. Everything. channel what's up you said uh you know why my wheels are not showing up I'm trying to find out and well only thing about something like that i mean you got a dirty mod just take it out your mod folder re-download it and if you do it again and then i mean you can't use it some of the mods are bad. That's a dirty mod issue there, boss. Dirty mod. How you I delete it, find it from somewhere else, and download it from somewhere else. So you fix that. Say a game I struggle with mods all the time is American Truck Simulator. That's why I don't really play it too much. That game is a mess. Mods, mods. I mean, it's pretty good. And if anything, use Seven Zip to extract your mods into the mod folder. The Seven Zip needs everything. Winrod does not get everything, but Seven Zip. Does. So it's the number seven ZIP. Download that software, and you can get your mods in. You just hit extract here, or extract either one. Same as WinRAW, and it gets everything into your mod folder. Seven zip. That. You shouldn't have those problems like that after you use it. It's not working. Yeah, we well just delete the mod, man. Just get it from somewhere else. I told you that. And if it don't work anywhere else, then that means you just can't use it. You trying to get what kind of mod you trying to get? Let me know, then I can show you.
Yeah, I have Discord. Yes. Um. Let's see here. Discord. Alright, I'm gonna give you my Discord info here. So you add me. Add me at. Subscribe and hit like. <clears throat> and let me know your name on Discord so I can know who you are. I'm going to feel the dude. everybody on Discord, you know, like the um, tutorial, how to get these mods in the right way. I got like, I got over 200 gigs worth of mods, and all of them work. All of them. Try capital M. <coughs> Hold on, man. I'm gonna just show you from this stream here. My Discord, look. Okay, it's Capital M, and then it's one capital F. Then when they ask you for the number, it's 9504. That's it. That's all you gotta do. Let me know when you did it.
I can't just type in Drew for ad friend, like you don't understand. It comes with a number behind it. See? So what you do Type in my name, capital M, and what I sent you, capital F, and then you hit left shift in the number three at the same time to make a number sign. So left shift, number three, that's your number sign. Then you do 9504. That's all you gotta do. I'm gonna do it again. All right, it's one of those and it will work, okay? I don't have time to be adding you. You don't give me any numbers behind your name. That's how it works on the ad friend. Since you two of them there, it can be one or the other. One of them work. Let's oh, add me on Discord. My name is Drew with no numbers behind it. It's unheard of. Man. It's not how Discord works.
six to me. You didn't even spell your own name right. Okay, I just added you. Now all you gotta do is just call me on Discord. I'll be out. Yeah, it just added you, man. I don't even see you or anything, so. I don't know what you're doing over there, but okay. Pick up, pick up what? I don't have missed calls or anything. All right, I see you. I'm going to call you. Yes, Drew Man. Okay, so what do you need help with? Yeah, yeah, turn the other, turn that sound down. It's too loud. I can hear it right back in my arm here. Yeah. Sorry. All right, so you need help with some mods. Okay, so first things first. 
and show you how to get them in properly. So if you continue to look at the stream, open up your internet browser, type in the number seven and use ZIP. Yes, and space it, Z as in Z it. Hold on. Hold on. My sound is like coming right back in my ear. I don't understand. Okay, I'm going to put, just look on the chat box. Download 7-Zip. So, you know, you download that software and all that good stuff and let me know, just let me know when you're done downloading that first. All right. And if you're using WinRAR, after you download 7-Zip, you need to delete WinRAR. Because WinRAR... What's that? Seven zip here. All right. So what you do, you use the one with the um latest date. It says seven zip beta. Download that one. It says three four twenty eighteen. That's the one you want. Download it from here. Have you finished downloading yet?
Nej. Okay. No, I don't because my mod folder is so big. I can't even share it. That's how big the mod folder is. I wish I could, but I can't. Oh, don't worry. No. Don't get it. Just, you know, it's a step by step process here on this all. Solid fertilizer. Let's do that I'm gonna show you how to do it all right okay so what do you see now is it runner or something like that or open Okay, well if it says download completed, nothing else, just exit out, just exit out at the top. Alright, so you did it. Okay, so what, do you have any mods at all? Hello? You don't have any mods at all, alright, good. That means you didn't download any mod software. Then. Okay, so okay, so you got a lot of storage on your hard drive. You got a lot. Like how much storage on your hard drive do you have? go to this PC or my PC and you'll see local disk and what you got what is it I can barely hear you all right you got Windows 10 Okay, but do you what what software are you running? You running Windows seven, eight, ten, what? Like what are you using? 
I'm trying to show you the easiest way you can look up your storage in your hard drive. Matthew O'Connor, what's up, Matthew? It's all my computer just set up. I can go to this PC and it shows me my hard drives here. All right, placeables. Let's see, fertilizer. Well, I'm trying to, you can't just download stuff and you don't know what you have on your hard drive. That's the whole point. Like, you need to know how much storage space you have because, you know, that's important to know. So you need to know how much space you got. I got like a three terabyte hooked up to my PC. simple things like the basics you gotta know how to locate certain areas on your computer so if something is like let's say one I mean most of my maps is like one gigabyte so if you don't got enough storage you won't be able to download it I'm trying to figure out how much storage you got or you can locate how much storage you have so you can know if you can download it or not that way we won't be wasting each other's time here Solid fertilizer, little smaller fields. Because that arm on that John Deere ain't gonna be able to do it. That you, uh -uh. All right. Nice. But is it 2,000 gigabytes, you say? Two terabytes, all right, cool. Now, 
I can show you how to do this. So just keep looking at the uh, YouTube screen here. So what you do, open up, open up your internet browser, right? Type in FS17, space it, M-O-D, space it, and M-O-D-S. Okay, so you're always looking for FS17 dot, it'll be dot A-L-T. It's the official site for mods. So what you do, you get in here, you look at, you look at like what you want. And, uh, hang on, let me stop my game and save it. I'm going to show you how to do this the easiest way. We are mod extracting school, everyone. Hang on. Okay. All right. So what you do, you find the one you want, and then you click on it. But you would see. Don't move too fast. Don't move too fast. Please don't. Just look at my screen. And, and um, just look at your screen and you can see how I do it. You're always looking for a download. And it'll be in green. So you hit download. And it'll say free download. You hit that. A pop-up will come up. So what you do, you exit out at the top. Exit out twice, and then you hit download file, and that's going to pop up again. So you exit out, exit out again. At the bottom, it will say, do you want to do, da 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 and yes, you hit save. And then you just let it download. You let it download after it's save. Don't touch anything. Like after you hit download, it'll say save. And if you see pop-ups, you know, you just X those pop-ups out. Just look at the YouTube and I, you know, I'm showing you here how to do this. Yeah, make sure whatever you're looking for is at the top in the tab. The tab is going to be open. Any additional tabs, you X them out. All right, it said it finished downloading. So once it finished downloading, you open the folder. You right click on what you just downloaded. It should be highlighted. Right click, hit copy. Then you paste it to your mods folder, extract it. Oh, All right, what you need to do now, let that download, go to this PC or my PC, because you have to create a mod folder.
Come on, let's go. Let me know when you're ready. Let's upload my screenshots for now. No, you did it wrong. You don't you don't do that. <sighs> you know, you don't mess with all of that stuff. I mean you don't you ain't listening, so I don't know, man. I was sitting there trying to show you how to do it, and it's like you're not listening. So you serious about the mods or what? Okay, so go to this PC or my PC. Then you go to documents. Let me know when you did that. Go to documents. Look on the YouTube. And you you see an uh, area where it say my games, or do you see in the game folders? Yeah, my games. All right, click on my games. See farming. Okay, so what you do? Click on that. Did you do it? Mm -hmm. Oh, you see at the top where it says new folder. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Click on new folder and name it MODS mods or something so you can know what you're doing. Okay. Alright, so you name it and then you push enter. Okay. So now, all you gotta do, exit out at the top right. So your mod folder is ready. Alright, now let's try this again with your mod issue here. And I'm gonna show you exactly how this works. Cause you have to pay attention cause you have pop-ups and all kind of bad stuff to be happening. And I'm gonna show you how to stop that. So, I can, what? I can barely hear you, you say what again? Yes, it's supposed to be empty because you haven't put anything in it. Yeah, and then you exit out. So you exit out. So go back on your Internet Explorer. Get on FS17 Mods, M-O-D-S. Then you look for FS17.alt. And you say you want John Deere, right? All right, but listen, I'm trying to do this with you and walk you through it. I'm going to show you how to do it. You say you want John Deere, right? Did you click on John Deere at the top where it says... Okay, so you're on the first page and you see John Deere 6135R. C 
six one three five and the letter R. Okay, we're gonna start with this because it has a four star ratio right there. I mean, it's a good mod. So click on it one time. And after you click on it, come down a little bit and you'll see at the at the right, and it's in green, it says download 833 megabytes. Click that. All right. All right, now one time you see where it says free download in blue. Yes. Click it. All right, and a pop up might come up. So, what you do at the top, exit out, it says close tab at the top on that pop up. Close the pop up. And download the file is a download file and another pop-up might come up so you hit close tab anything that pops up at the top Exit out. Anything that pops up at the top, if a new tab opens, exit out at the top. It's a, it's a red X. You exit out. Okay, so um, that was at the bottom after you hit save, right? Like you see on my screen what's going on on, on the channel? Did you do it like that or what? Okay, so let me know when it's finished downloading. All right. Just look at just look at the screen. You can remember how I'm doing this cuz I'm gonna download another one. You can download 
excess top. What's that? Save it. If I were you, I would do one at a time because it's a certain way you have to extract it. Yeah, mine's downloading slow too. I mean, they got high traffic. A lot of people downloading mods today. They usually go fast. Is it done? No, but see, it's not that simple because you have to, well, what you do, you have to copy. If you can write this down, you got to copy it. Like, once it finished downloading, you hit open, open file or whatever. Then you copy it because it should be highlighted in blue. You copy it, then you look for your mod folder, and it should say mods or whatever you named it. You open that folder, and then you right click it and hit paste. And then after you paste it, man, you might as well wait because you ain't gonna, you don't know what you're doing. It's your first time doing this, so you might as well wait, dude. Go ahead and wait. I'm going to stop my stream, so I'm going to stay in the Discord. A couple minutes, y'all, on the stream, and we'll be back. Jesus Christ. 